I'm so excited about this research problem because there's been a paradox in why older adults get pneumonia. The bacteria that causes pneumonia can often live in the noses or the mouths of young kids or young adults and we never ever find it in the noses or the mouth of older adults and yet they get infections really quickly. We hypothesized that maybe that was because the microbes that naturally live in your nose and mouth change with age. And the microbes who naturally live in your nose and your mouth, they want to keep those bad bacteria out as well because if the immune system gets involved, they'll be killed as well. We hypothesized that older adults might be losing these good microbes that protect us from the bad bacteria. And so what we've done is we've done a study looking to see if that's the case and understanding how the aging immune system can no longer support the good bacteria in their nose and leave us susceptible to getting bad bacteria. So we think that if we can understand which are the good microbes in our nose, which keep those bad bacteria out, we might be able to develop probiotics for the nose, sort of a, a spray or a, something you squirt up your nose that fills this area up with good bacteria and doesn't allow bad bacteria to enter. My personal passion is the health of older adults and unfortunately they are the ones who bear the brunt of lung health issues. They have more chronic lung conditions and once they get infections like pneumonia, there are long-term health consequences that we, we can do nothing about. And so for me, it's an essential part of keeping older adults healthy, ha happy, active in their communities and their families for longer.